Good evening. Can you see me? Yeah. All right. Can you see me? No, I cannot see you. Really? You, have no, you have no camera. Hello? Yeah, there you go. Oh. Again, again. Right. <coughs> Call me back, please. There you go. Your camera is on already. Uh, oh, it's gone again. Uh, oh, there you go. Yeah, I can see you now. <laughs> what happened? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe something is wrong with the internet. Maybe, maybe uh, my children use this chat that. Ah, okay. Uh, yeah, you're kind of blurry in the video. But anyways, let's start. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> I think the connection has broken. Yeah, I think the connection is very low, slow. That's why on, yeah. But I can see the screen clearly now. Okay. All right, <laughs> so we are now going to proceed with our new topic. Like how are things, okay? We're not yet here, right? We, we stopped yesterday with this one, correct? Yeah, yes. Yeah. Now we are going to proceed on this one. Yeah. Are we are we done here? Yes, we're done here. Are we done here? Yes, yes we're done yeah. here. Yeah. Uh so here. Yeah. Correct? Not yet. Yeah. Okay. I want you to read the instruction <laughs> first. Yeah. The way you say a question. Chat is its meaning. Listen to the same sentence spoken choice. In A, the speaker is asking a genuine question, but in B, the speaker is asking for agreement. Yes. Okay. A. Okay. What about number two? Read first. Number two, circle the correct answer to complete the rules. To add a genuine, gen, what is genuine mean? Um, like, um, like a real, a genuine question, a real question. A real question, yeah. Yeah, a real, a real one. <clears throat> to add a genuine question, your voice should go up or down. To ask for to agreement, ask? your voice, ask. For to agreement. ask for agreement, your voice. your voice should go up or down. Your voice yes. should All go right. up or down. Okay, <laughs> we're going to yeah. listen now to truck number six. Six. Recording six. A. Helen lives in Hong Kong, doesn't she? <laughs> B. Helen lives in Hong Kong, doesn't she? All right. Yeah. This one is. On the letter A, the speaker is asking, right? And on, yeah. like, if you can hear on the audio, the tone of the voice is going up, right? Okay. So, yeah. Helen lives in Hong Kong, doesn't she? On this one, on letter B, it's about <coughs> an agreement, or do you... Agree. Okay. Helen lives in Hong Kong, doesn't she? Like that. Okay, yeah. this one, the, 
uh, on the letter A, the question is doesn't have an answer yet. This one is the speaker. The speakers know already where Helen lives, and the speaker wants an agreement or to agree. All right. So here. So, what about number two? Number two, to mm -hmm. ask a genuine question, your voice should go up. Very good. And to ask for agreement, your voice should go down. Very good. Now here. Listen, Listen to these sentences. To Again, go read. I'm sorry. Listen to these sentences and tick the ones that are genuine questions. Mm -hmm. Listen to these sentences and tick the ones that are genuine questions. Okay. Now let's try to listen. Track number seven. Okay. Building seven. A. Seven are divorced, aren't they? You don't want to go out tonight, do you? C. Jason can speak French, can't he? D. You haven't had dinner yet, have you? E. She won't come to the party, will she? I didn't forget your birthday, did I? G. He looks much younger than her, doesn't he? H. We're not going in there, are we? I. Everything will be all right, won't it? J. I'm not late, am I? Okay. Yeah. Right, now what letters that has a genuine questions? Mm. Letter A, D, F, H, and G. Very good. Right. Now we're going to listen again and repeat each sentence using the same intonation okay after you hear it you speak okay, okay. recording seven a sam and kevin are divorced aren't they yeah. b you don't want to go out tonight do you you don't want to go out tonight don't you c Jason can speak French, can't he? They can speak French, can he? D. You haven't eaten dinner yet, have you? You haven't eaten dinner yet, have you? You haven't e. eaten. She e. won't come to the party, will she? She so will come to the party, will she? F. F. I didn't forget your birthday, did I? I didn't forget your birthday, didn't I? G. He looks much younger than her, doesn't he? She looks much younger than her, does he? H. We're not going in there, are we? We're not going in there. Oh. We'll be all right, won't it? I'm not late, am I? I'm not late, am I? All right. So as you can see, you know now already how to rise and fall your statement or the sentence. When it's going up, it's about genuine question. Right? When it's going down, it's about 
agreement. Okay? Now here. Read. You can turn a statement into a question by asking a question tag. We add a next question tag to a positive statement. What was a great movie, wasn't it? Positive. We add a positive question tag to a negative statement. You didn't see Mickey, did you? All right, so this is about the negative question, right? Or if you are agreeing or not, okay? I'm sorry. Now turn this each statement into a question by adding a question tag. So this is a, what you call a question tag, okay? Mm. Like for example, this one. Isn't she? Don't you? Would she? Have you? So these are the question tag. Okay? So number one are being given. So aren't they? Okay? So these are the choices that you are going to use. Okay? So for example, number one. Those are my keys. Aren't they? All right? So the answer for this one is aren't they? Now can you do letter B? Mm. Lisa is a police. Again, again, police. again, again. Lisa is a police officer. Isn't she? Isn't she? That is correct. I don't understand the sentence like Lisa is a police officer. Isn't she? Yeah. Different. It's, it's a different if. Uh, the sentence is, Lisa is a police officer, is she? Isn't she? Isn't she? But, but I, I say that Lisa is a police officer, is she? It is isn't correct. Isn't she? No, isn't, isn't she? she? It's like you are asking a confirmation. If it's um, Lisa is a real police officer. Because you are not sure if Lisa is really a police officer. So this is also a confirmation. Isn't she? Mm. It's like that. So this is a genuine question. Isn't mm. she? All right. You get it now? You understand? Because if I give the question like, Lisa is a police officer. Is she? It is correct? No. Isn't she? Or, yeah, it can be. Is she? Yes, that can be. But we in this topic, we are talking about adding a negative question. This one, the wasn't. Okay? But also this one, this is a positive question tagging. Is she? Right? If this is a, you started the statement in a negative. So we add positive question. Right, for the example, this one. You didn't see Mickey. So this is a negative statement, right? Because of the word didn't, right? So you didn't see Mickey. So we add positive question. Did you to ask for a? Confirmation of the question. Right? Now this one here, this is a positive statement. And we only add negative question. This one. Okay? Yeah. Now this one over here, we are going to add questions, question tags. So question tags that are Positive question tag or negative question tag. This one, have you. Have you is a positive. This one is a positive question tag. Have you? Because if this one is not um, a positive question, if, if this one is a negative, this will become haven't you? Right? 
Okay. 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 Now let's try answer letter C. Yeah. You didn't say that, did you? You didn't say that. Say that. Did, did you? you? That is correct. Letter D. You, you know I'm right. Don't you? Don't you? Yes, that is correct. We we always be friends. One we one we. One we. That is correct. You don't know the answer, do you? Don't do you? Yeah, that is correct. You wouldn't leave me alone here, would you? That is correct. We shouldn't be here, should we? That is correct. You haven't seen this film before, have you? Next. We will. They will. We will be here on time. They will. Won't be. we? Again. They. They. they will. They. They will be here on time. Won't they? That is correct. You haven't got a brother, have you? Very good. That letter was a bit boring, wasn't it? Wasn't it? That is correct. You got everything correct. So do you have any confusion? You get it now? Everything yet you answer is correct. So which part yeah. is your, like, you're not sure? I understand what um, the slide I understand the question, but I'm not sure uh, why you you uh, positive or negative question. <laughs> but <laughs> well, I think, but I think, uh, uh, yeah. 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 yeah, those are just. It's okay. Um, <laughs> these are just um, like statement or the opening statement of the question. So this over here are the confirmation. Especially when you don't really know yeah. if the statement is correct, or if you are asking a person and you don't, and you are not really sure with what you are asking. For example, yeah, you have an you had an um, a reunion with your classmates, your high school classmates, and you know this person. That, I mean, like you saw this person like two years ago with someone else for example a boy a boy you saw this boy with a girl before so you but you didn't have the chance to talk with that person so when you saw this person again in that reunion you tried to ask him oh i saw you before in this mall in that mall and i think you're married are you Aren't you? Right? So are you, you are not sure. Are you? Uh, are you? Yeah. yeah. Like, I saw you before in this, mall, uh, in this mall, and I'm not sure if you're married. Aren't you? Aren't you? Okay. Uh, yeah. Just like that. Okay? Okay. Clear now? Oh, mm, I, I try think, to again. use it more often. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. You know what? I, I, I've seen this um, idea. Like, ja you know Jackie Chan, right? Jackie Chan, the film actor, you know, who do a lot of judo and karate. Jackie Chan. I saw his video when he first go to yeah. America. Yes. Sorry. When he first go to America, he don't know how to speak English. So what he yeah. did is that he listened to the music. And then he tried to write down what he hears on the music. And also do not use 
do not use when you try to practice using song, music do not use the rap just a love songs like that okay and then you try to write that okay that's yeah. an, a, another okay. tip for you to learn um, your hearing English speaking skills okay yeah. all right now let's try to go for our track number eight read Listen and mark a conversation one to sit with a topic I to F. Right over here, okay? Okay. Recording eight. Conversation one. I think there are too many of them. Kids are under too much pressure at school. That's exactly what I think. There should be more learning rather than testing. Conversation two. From my point of view, if you don't eat meat, you can't have a balanced diet. That's not right at all. You don't have to eat meat to be healthy. Conversation three. It seems to me that there should be a limit on the number of cars and lorries. The situation is getting out of control. I couldn't agree more. The government should definitely do something. Conversation four. I believe that if you fancy a cigarette in a restaurant after a nice meal, then you should be able to have one. No way. I don't agree. The smell is terrible. Conversation five. I feel it's going to be a huge health problem in a few years' time. I think so too, definitely. It's bad for the body to be overweight, but people just don't seem to listen. Conversation six. Well, I think they're bad for kids. I mean, they spend all day staring at the screen rather than playing with friends. I don't think so. They can learn a lot by playing these things too, you know. All right. Did you get it? Yes. Okay. So number one, it was given an example that yeah. it's about agreeing. Okay. Now, what about number two? Mm, number two is about vegetarianism. I'm sorry? Vegetarianism. Number, yeah. Very good. What about number three? Number three is about traffic. It's about traffic. Number four? Number four is about smoking. All right. Is. Please do not shortcut. Number okay. Eight. Go, go, continue. Sorry. Number F. Continue. Sorry. Yes, continue. Uh, number five is about. Again. Number five is Please about. Please do not obesity. shortcut. You are making a shortcut. Do not say number five A. You try to pronounce is. Okay, everything you, you you shortcut. Okay, it's like we're not learning okay. again. Number, Number five. five is is about obesity. Yes, very good. And number six is about computer is about computer games. Computer games. Right now, pronounce yes. number six. Six. Number six. 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 Again? Six. 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 Okay. Six. 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 Very good. That's it. Again. Six. Very good. That's it. Okay. And what about this one? Uh, can, can I listen again? Five. Yeah, five. No, no, no. What number is this one? You pronounce this number. Five. Five, okay? Because you pronounce it as five. Not five. <laughs> okay? Five. But this one is not four. This one is four. Four. OK, 
Okay? Very good. Yeah. Yeah. Don't forget that, okay? Now, let's yeah. try to listen once more with three expressions in each column, okay? Over here, expressions to agree with someone. An expression to disagree with someone, okay? Agree and disagree, okay? So you, you list, you list down the statement that are agree and disagree, okay? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Recording eight, conversation one. I think there are too many of them. Kids are under too much pressure at school. That's exactly what I think. There should be more learning rather than testing. Conversation two. From my point of view, if you don't eat meat, you can't have a balanced diet. That's not right at all. You don't have to eat meat to be healthy. Conversation three. It seems to me that there should be a limit on the number of cars and lorries. The situation is getting out of control. I couldn't agree more. The government should definitely do something. Conversation four. I believe that if you fancy a cigarette in a restaurant after a nice meal, then you should be able to have one. No way. I don't agree. The smell is terrible. Conversation five. I feel it's going to be a huge health problem in a few years' time. I think so too, definitely. It's bad for the body to be overweight, but people just don't seem to listen. Conversation six. Well, I think they're bad for kids. I mean, they spend all day staring at the screen rather than playing with friends. I don't think so. They can learn a lot by playing these things too, you know. Did you get it? Yes. All right. Now you tell me your answer. Mm. This one the first. Same. Expression. Mm. Agree to someone. So this one is the first. That's exactly what I think. All right. You can hear that one. What else? Sorry. I think I will do the sentence too. You will do the agree, agree or disagree. Yes. No, no, you're not going to agree or disagree. You will write the statement that is, that is expressed that um having an expressions that is being agreed with someone and expressions that disagreeing with someone okay so for example mm -hmm. all right I, I will let you listen again recording eight yeah. conversation one i think there are too many of them kids are under too much pressure at school that's exactly what i think all right so yeah. that's exactly what i think right so the girl agreed with the first statement Okay. Yeah. Now, let's continue listening. There should be more learning rather than testing. Conversation two. From my point of view, if you don't eat meat, you can't have a balanced diet. That's not right at all. You don't have to eat meat to be healthy. All right. So, what's the expression? That's not right at all. all That's right. not right at all. So, it's a... Mystery. Disagree. You don't need to eat meat to be healthy. Okay. Conversation three. It seems to me that there should be a limit on the number of cars and lorries. The situation is getting out of control. I couldn't agree more. The government should definitely. So that is a. Disagree. No, that's an agree. I couldn't agree more. It means that. He is agreeing. The woman, the old lady in the audio, is agreeing with the statement of the person who is talking about the traffic. Okay? I couldn't agree more. Yes. That's yes. 
You try to listen to her statement. Conversation three. It seems to me that there should be a limit on the number of cars and lorries. The situation is getting out of control. I couldn't agree more. The government should definitely do something. Right? I couldn't agree more. Right? So it means that he is... It's not like the word I couldn't agree more. Right? He is agreeing. It means that he is agreeing with the person's statement about... The traffic about um, how should the government do or do something with this situation. All right, let's proceed. To four. I believe that if you fancy a cigarette in a restaurant after a nice meal, then you should be able to have one. No way. I don't agree. The smell is terrible. Right, so that is... Disagree. Disagree. No What's the way. statement? No way. I, I can hear the word. No way. <laughs> no way. The smell is terrible. Right? All right, let's proceed. Conversation five. I feel it's going to be a huge health problem in a few years' time. I think so too, definitely. It's bad for the body to be overweight, but people just don't seem to listen. Conversation C. So that is... Uh, let's listen again. Problem in a few years' time. The smell is terrible. Conversation 5. I feel it's going to be a huge health problem in a few years' time. I think so too, definitely. It's bad for the body to be overweight, but people just don't seem to listen. All right, so that is... Agreeing okay. statement. Yes, right? So agreeing with that it's bad to be overweight. Yeah. Conversation I bad for kids. I mean, spend all day staring at the screen rather than playing with friends. I don't think so. They can learn a lot by playing these things too, you know. All right. So that is disagree. Disagree. Why? Because she don't think so. She don't think so, right? Because some of the computer games might help the learnings of the children okay that's what she thinks anyways we're already in 33 minutes okay thank you so much that was a quite interesting topic today and i hope you still enjoy it even though it's very confusing all right enjoy the rest of the evening i'll see you tomorrow okay bye yes i'll see you tomorrow bye bye